Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Most of our G-cab range, Terriers, Boxers, Clydesdales and Reavers, are built by Leyland in Scotland at our Bathgate plant near Edinburgh. Bathgate is also the centre for a major investment programme, concentrating on trucks at the lighter end of our vehicle range. So it will be no surprise that our main presentation concentrates on the Super G-cab range. We've written a musical. Yes, that's right, a musical. It stars a part of the reason you decided to come here tonight. The story is our family story. Our reflection of how tonight's presentation may have come about, and I admit our optimistic forecast of its conclusion. Ladies and gentlemen, I said it was a musical. We've called it Just Another Truck. So please sit back, relax, and above all, enjoy yourselves. As I was saying... Yes, dear? We've got a truck stuck in the service bay A broken compressor, what can I say? Our main supplier says he hasn't got the spare So it's down to me, no other bugger can see what I mean Yes, dear? The truck 667S. The shackle pins have gone, they're a hell of a mess. Every six months they need to be replaced. It's the way the new lad drives, it's a bloody disgrace. See what I mean? Yes, dear. There's double eight, five B, supposed to be new. The steering's heavier than the QE2. The kingpins keep seizing, even when they're greased. It's got some pain, I've said for the priest, see what I mean. Yes, dear. Then one of my cowboys on the road, he got stopped because of an insecure load. And another burp and excessive smoke, got a GV9, it's beyond a joke. The injector went. And I'd like to know, is there any end to this tale of woe? See what I mean? Yes, dear. Now the drivers have seen those bloody continentals. They think they beat the Ford and Bedfords and frilly cushions for their bums. and chromium are of a scene from house and garden they're all behaving like pier carden a bunch of foreign gigolos yes dear oh well that's that a better day ahead a brand new truck i must get to bed and when i do i know i'll shed my load with another new truck on the road, see what I mean. I'm afraid I do. See what I mean. I'm afraid I do. See what I mean. I'm afraid I do. Yes, dear.
Another truck on the road, another truck on the road. With singular vision, he turns the ignition. Another truck on the road. I sit here hoping, could he be tempted to find a location? I sit here dreaming, is it a trip to the south of Spain? Will he complain yet again about another truck on the road? Another truck on the road, another truck on the road, with a fleet to keep, he's already asleep. Another truck on the road Will things change? Will the worries disappear? When can I have a normal life With less truck strife? for the day when he'll come home and say we got another truck on the road and it's working today
trying to sell me all night. I didn't know you was for sale. All night, Ford, Bedford, Leyland, you name it, I got it. What, trying to sell you? It's amazing, they've all got their good points you know. But in the end, it comes down to cost effectiveness and reliability. What? Well, I don't know what the firm do without you, Mr. Pretty. Oh, thank you, Wendy, that's very nice of you. But I think you're worth every penny. Yeah, well, you know, it is, I do my best and you know, no, not me. Trucks. Trucks? Yeah, trucks. 
That's what they was trying to sell me last night in my dream. Oh. The best truck on the market. I'm about as wise now as I ever was. What do you mean you don't know which one is the best? I mean, I thought I did. They've all got something going for them. But there was, there was something last night about a, about a great British truck. All right now, eh? Yeah. What about them boxers? They're British, aren't they? Oh yeah, they're British, all right. British bleeding Leyland. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pretty. Pretty. Ah, I'm Belvedere. Yeah, well, don't let it get you down, son. <laughs> Leyland Vehicles. Oh, yes, my governor asked me to have a word with you. Thank you. Now, listen, son, I don't want to discourage you, but you are wasting your time. <coughs> I like that. It indicates single-mindedness, a sense of purpose, knowing where you're going, knowing What's best for the company, keeping your options open? It does. It certainly does. I knew you and I had something in common from the moment we met. Um, may I? What? Yes, if you must. Well, now let's get down to business. You run mainly Ford at the moment, don't you? Yeah, but we're taking a closer look at that new GL now that it's finally been released. And quite right too, Mr. Pretty, it's a much better product. It is? It certainly is, in many respects. What do you mean, in many respects? Well, it stands to reason, doesn't it? I mean, think about it. TK was good, and they've improved it. But that doesn't mean to say it's any better than Ford, in many respects, or, for that matter, our middleweight Leyland range. <laughs> you think that Leyland is best, right? Wrong. Let's face it, Mr. Pretty, if Leyland was automatically the best, you'd be running them, right? Right. No, Mr. Pretty, the plain truth is they've all got their good points, and frankly, there's not much to choose between them. On the other hand, you have to take account of how our trucks have improved. Oh, you mean that restyled Super G cab you're going to bring out? Well, the new Super G is available now and simply a class ahead of anything on the market today, including that new Bedford. No, no, it's more than that, Mr. Pretty. I mean, you take Terrier, for instance. Powered by the improved 98 series engine, five-speed gearbox standard and better steering. Take the Clydesdale, that's been Britain's best-selling 16-tonner for years. Take the Boxer, now powered by the 698 turbo engine. That's certainly one of the best on payload, power, cost, economy and reliability. <laughs> reliability? Since when? Listen, son, I've got a brand new Ford truck out there on the road today, so don't you give me any cobblers about... Hang on a minute. <laughs> Hello, yes, this is pretty. What? All right, where are you? <laughs> In the middle of Dagenham High Street. <laughs> the big ends, God, what are you talking about? It's a brand new truck. All right, stay where you are. I'll send a break down there. What do you... What, what do you mean the police are towing it away? <laughs> oh, oh, God. Blimey. He ain't even got his bloody bus fare.
<laughs> You're looking pleased with yourself. <laughs> Sold another truck? No, but nearly as good. I've got another important customer to go to the Cambridge Theatre. What exactly is going on there? Well, it's like this, Mrs. Belvedere. <clears throat> we, Sir Michael and I, are going to get all the important truck operators together with our distributors, and we... Sir Michael and you. ...are going to tell them about the development of our range, including the new Super G-Cab. Then we're going to hit them with an offer they can't refuse and sell them millions, zillions of trucks. What do you think about that? You don't make zillions of trucks. No, but we make quite a few, particularly at our Bathgate factory in Scotland. OK, you make a lot of trucks. So? So what? Darling, you are irritating sometimes. You're getting all of these truck operators together, and you're going to sell all those trucks. How? Ah, well, you see, what we're going to do is we're going to get our distributors to lay on cars and coaches and things and take the operators to theatres we booked up and down the country. Why theatres? Well, we're laying on this big presentation. Professional actors, original music, moving sets, just like a real West End show. Lots of dancers. Yeah. Beautiful, young, sensuous bodies. Yeah. Are you going? <coughs> um... Uh, yeah, well, it's like this, you see. Yes. Um, uh, believe me, it's strictly business. You see, what we're doing is we're giving them a drink, then we're showing them how big we are with the slide program on Leyland Trucks Worldwide. Then, well, then there's this little musical. <laughs> it's not that impressive, but we'll be showing them more of our new trucks, like the Sleeper Cab T45 and our new facelifted G-Cab. But just a little musical. Oh, yeah, nothing spectacular. I wouldn't like it. Oh, no, 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 you'd be bored. With all those dancers. Uh, oh, come on, darling. Oh. oh, OK, then. So what's the offer they can't refuse? Ah, uh, well, the only person who knows that is my governor, and he's playing it close to his chest. He's probably going to let them all have one for free and pay when they're satisfied. Darling, I've got news for you. Customers are never satisfied. That's why products keep improving, and that's just what's happened with the Leyland range. You mean you've improved it? Oh, yeah. I mean, take Terrier and Boxer, for instance. You see, at the end of 77, we introduced a much higher powered and more economical engine, the 98 series. Oh, don't get all technical. All right. And then in 78, we stiffened the block, fitted iron insert pistons, put in chrome flash liners, and then introduced our new Super G. You dirty beast. Then we raised gross vehicle weight to increase payload on the boxer and introduced low loading height for easier handling. I've got a low loading height. Then last year, we introduced an overdrive gearbox option to improve performance. Very sexy, these trucks of yours. We need to make everyone aware that our new Super G-Cab was already as good as the competition, and now in many cases actually better. Then, then we hit them with that special offer. And uh, when you do these uh, little musicals, do you think your luck is going to change? Do you know, darling, I think it's changing already. All right, when the police took it away, what did you do? <laughs> I went down a pound, and then you brought it back. How could I? The big end was gone. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Not that big end. <laughs> Come in. Now look here, Bill. Oh, God. Blimey. Never you mind about your old boy, Blimey. We've got serious problems out there. Do you know some of these youngsters haven't been properly trained? And the spare parts situation ain't what it ought to be. You're fully aware of that. Do you know this is the third one of these I've had go this week? Look here, Bill. I've been with this firm for 20 years yeah, now. Yeah, so some of our trucks. Well, what are you going to do about it? Well, it's not the sort of problem you can cure overnight, is it? What we need is some new trucks. Well, we need some new drivers, mate. Yeah, and what we need is some new servicing. You left me bleeding roasting down in Dagenham. That was a brand new bloody truck you had. All right, all right. <laughs> Leave it. Cool. No. What happened yesterday was an accident. Could happen to anybody. Now listen. We've got to update the fleet. We've got to establish better training facilities all round. We've got to get better cooperation on parts and services. And we've got to try and establish some sort of a system for analysing these problems before they happen. Perhaps everyone should get new overalls. Perhaps you should have an overall. I had one last night. <laughs> Listen, I was thinking of making a change. Now, what about these new terriers and these new boxes? 
You're talking about the bedroom. I'm talking about the terriers and the boxes. I didn't know they were new. Well, they're not new, but I mean, they've, they've improved them enormously over the past couple of years. I knew a boxer once. You what? Yeah, ever so nice he was. Only trouble was his nose was so bent, it ruined my mascara. <laughs> yeah, well, what do you think? <laughs> I'll have to familiarise myself with the specifications. You see, it's so long since I handled anything but a, a Ford, isn't it? The G cab sure it. So is them ergo watch it. ergo -matics. That's all very well, but what about reliability? Well, we haven't exactly got a bit of roses here, have we? Anyway, they're pulling their socks <coughs> up later. <laughs> What's so funny? British Leyland. Not British Leyland. Leyland vehicles. Anyway, I'm going out to this presentation, see if I can find out a bit more. Anyway, what have I got to lose? Another big end. <laughs> all right, you might agree with all that, but your drivers are f familiar with current vehicles, which may or may not be Leyland. So why try something new? Your fitters may be used to handling Fords, Bedfords, Volvos or whatever. So why change to something you're not familiar with? Yes, we do understand these concerns. So here's what we're going to do. For every Leyland truck you order between now and the end of the year, we are going to provide the following. Number one. With that vehicle, we are going to give you free fitter training where required, and free driver training. Now, after all, you made the change to your existing vehicles once, and presumably that was a good investment. Well, here's a special opportunity to make a change for the better once again. Number two, we are going to give you a free livery design service. From now on, when you buy a truck from Leyland, it'll come out looking so good, you won't believe it. Free livery design if you want it. Now on top of those two items, for every Leyland truck you order between now and the end of the year, you can have number three, free truck charge payment card membership, the means by which you or your driver can pay for repair or recovery work carried out by a Leyland distributor and incurred outside normal working hours. Number four, Truck cover, our second year insurance plan, providing total breakdown insurance on major items such as engine, gearbox and axle, which after the first year of ownership will take over totally free of charge for another year. And here's the reason we feel confident in making these free offers. SAVE, it stands for System for Analyzing Vehicle Expense. It applies basically to fleet owners and means that whatever make or type of vehicle, whether Leyland or any of the competition, it is thoroughly analysed every single month with a series of carefully structured reports. So the fleet owner very soon knows which vehicles are reliable and which ones are not. So five, if you run more than ten vehicles, you can have the save system totally free for a six-month trial. This is the simplest way for you to prove to yourself how much cheaper and reliable Leyland trucks are in comparison to any equivalent truck within your fleet. Plus, how would you like a guarantee on the value of your truck? First of all, you buy at the very best price. At the same time, we guarantee the value of that truck over either a two or three or four-year period. This could mean you only a terrier for less than 25 pounds a week. So there it is, guaranteed residual value, and that's on top of free fitter training and driver induction, free livery design service, free truck charge, free truck cover, and free save. All of that if you place your order between now and the end of the year. And ladies and gentlemen, the price of that vehicle will meet the very best price you can get from any of our competitors. So how about taking the vehicle now 
and paying a bit later. You'll still get a good deal, tell your distributor what you want, and providing it's economically reasonable from everybody's point of view, let's do it. It all adds up to Flexi Deal, an offer we think you will find very easy to accept. I didn't get what I am today by not recognizing progress. We've got to keep up with the times. Things don't stand still. A bird in the hand isn't necessarily worth two in the bush. <laughs> it isn't necessarily. <laughs> And remember, we have got to keep on trucking. Have a yogi. <laughs> no, no, thank you, sir. Not today. Uh, as a matter of fact, I was thinking of having a Leyland. In fact, I was thinking of having several Leylands. Leyland, eh? Yeah, I could negotiate a very good deal. You could? Oh, oh, oh could I? Here, listen to this. Free livery design, free truck charge, free truck cover for the second year, free trial of safe for the first six months. Safe? What's that? Well, that means system for analysing vehicle expense. And it means we can actually check reliability and a lot more against our own fleet. Sounds good. And that's not all. I think I can persuade them to give us free fitter and driver training, plus a discount. Pretty! I didn't get where I am today by dilly-dallying, shilly-shallying, or being... Um, or, 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 or being... Uh, what, indecisive. Or being indecisive. Go out and buy a...
Thank you.